Hi, hi everybody. I'm Sarah Pillsbury. I was the drinking water administrator at the Department of Environmental Services in New Hampshire for about 16 years. Um, I, I guess 2004 to, to, to 2020. The, and, uh, the program I wanted to talk about in terms of great success in my state, I don't think anybody will be surprised to hear that I'm going to pick the source water protection program. We delineated the, the wellhead protection areas. We um, then work with state and local folks to get protection into those areas. At the same time that I was figuring out where the wellhead protection areas were, we had all these waste site programs in our organization that were being stood up, uh, in particular, the leaking underground storage tank. We had a lot of leaking underground storage tanks and we had very shallow aquifer. And by having the wellhead protection area, we were able to provide the actual locations. We were able to help with prioritization. And the other thing is because source water protection was being pushed at the federal level and, and you know, we had this new plan and we were all excited about it. And one of the things that we got passed was a, a um, water supply land grant program in order to protect the lands around our wells and intakes. And, you know, what the, this did was to um, really leave us with well-protected existing sources, but also places for new sources. Though it was not necessarily their goal, it led to a fair amount of environmental protection in that we have some really large tracts in New Hampshire where the ecosystems, the habitats are protected, and many of them are places where, where people can go and um, enjoy the beautiful place that is New Hampshire. With that